Welcome to Let's Find Out. This time we made a video for Harry Potter fans. This video will tell you which house you are belong to. We assure you this is 100 times better than sorting hat. You'll answer 15 questions. Let's start the video. Imagine you have a wand and you can do any magic with it. What do you want its core to be made of? What do you do to achieve your goals? Which one of the following elements is most appealing to you? Look at your living room walls, what's most outstanding? What is your magical transportation model? What kind of dessert do you usually order after a meal? If you were the school principal, how would you choose the students? What is your zodiac sign? What are you curious about? How do your friends describe you? How do you react if anyone humiliates you? What is your favorite movie genre?
You went to a forest camp with your friends. What do you do if you are threatened by a wild animal? What do you typically do when you get together with your friends at home? What's your Quidditch position? If you scored between 150 and 300, you are Hufflepuff. You have to be in the Hufflepuff house because you are a patient person and you work hard to achieve your dreams. You have a great team spirit and you support your fans with everything. You have also a down-to-earth personality, so you always take a stand against injustice. If you scored between 310 and 420, you are Ravenclaw. You have to be in the Ravenclaw house because you are a creative and intelligent person and generally successful academically. You think very logically in critical circumstances and usually have unique ideas. You are highly known for your humor and memory based abilities. If you scored between 430 and 520, you are Slytherin. You have to be in the Slytherin house because you are a very mysterious and shrewd person. In a situation that benefits you, you can ignore the rules and not be afraid of it. You are always trying to get ahead and will do whatever you can to be in a position of power. If you scored between 530 and 600, you are Gryffindor. You have to be in the Gryffindor house because you are a brave and chivalrous person. You have a very well defined sense of right and wrong and you always help your friends. You are not afraid of anything to achieve your goal. Thanks for watching the video. Please write your thoughts in the comments. If you liked the video, you could subscribe our channel. See you next time. Thank you.